right, here we are, another mission, and I'm right in the thick of it at the moment, as you can see. Um, probably another hour or two to go, and we will um, get to where I want to camp, because I am loaded, um, loaded to the max. Anyway, we'll keep going. We'll see you out there. Should be good going to explore a brand new spot. Never tried it before. Nice big slippery slide here. Just trying to avoid. And um, it might almost be where I want to go. Don't really want to keep walking much further. How's the amount of water? Almost didn't need to bring water, that would have saved me a couple of kilo. Need to treat it all though. Slight like animal trail here. Here we go. Found somewhere I reckon. Um, probably flat enough. Maybe I'll wedge in there. I don't know. This looks like a good base so I just want to get stuff off, so let's drop it. Alright, we found our spot. I'm going to pitch my tent just here, I think. But we'll deal with that later. Ready to go fishing now, rigged up. Going to throw light outfit, which is PE3 Dreamcast rod. Um, 30 pound Tasline, 5k Saragosa. 60 pound leader. Got a jig on there. See if we can get something on that. If not, I'll swap to a plastic. Um, I definitely don't do the best with jigs, just being honest. But um, I know they do catch fish. And then we got the heavy outfit, which is a P8 prototype by Ocean's Legacy. Um, 20k Stella. 100 pound Tasline and 200 pound Momoi leader and a Big fat, um, gone blank, and a uh, um, jerk shad, 18 inch jerk shad. Um, yeah, I'm gonna wander down on the rocks now. Got all the rope, got a brand new gaff actually, I'll show you that. Everyone, like one of the most common questions I get is, um, where do I get a cliff gaff? And um, so I'll throw a link in the description um, if you want to check it out. I don't know if they ship to worldwide yet. It's just Australia. But he's, um, I spoke to the guy that makes them and he's working on um, getting it set up for international shipping. So anyway, we'll try it out. We'll see how it goes. Four pronger instead, tiny bit heavier. My other one was 316 stainless steel on the bottom and then like zinc on top. It's quite common like that and it's crap because they just rust and flake and um, this one's 316 the whole lot, so keen to give it a go. Um, hopefully we actually catch something big enough to make use of it. Anyway, let's get down there, we'll get the ropes in, we'll start casting. Alright. This is the spot. We'll get set up. Definitely get a rope in because I don't want to go swimming here and um, catch some dinner. So I got nothing for dinner. So we can get plenty of rope. Which one do I want? Oh yeah, there we go. That's the one I was after. All right, here we go. I um, I did bring out a normal snapper lead, at least one. I can't find it at the moment. I'll probably find it when I set up camp. I've probably thrown it in somewhere. So we run this for now. It doesn't really matter because the spikes just pop out when I need them to anyway. Um, bit of herring. I um. 
it's kind of thread a bit of herring on there I caught some herring on the school holidays when I went camping with the family and most of them just went in the freezer as bait so that's what we're using catch your own bait probably end up catching my own bait on this trip if I have to I'll take these down Yeah, fishy, 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 fishy. Should get something eventually. Got something, yes. <coughs> I can't believe it. I'm almost in shock. Oh, it's fighting pretty hard. Come on. What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? What is that? Is that a groper? There's two, I got a groper. A groper on a bit of herring. I thought it might have been. Oh well, that's dinner. If I can land it. We gotta land it first. I'd say I've got one hook in it. All right. Yeah. So now. I'll just back that drag way off. So that if I somehow drop my dinner. That was like something picking at it as well. I didn't expect to hook anything decent. All right, dinner. That's dinner. Right there. Nice size groper, probably perfect size for me, really. Um, sorted. So, I didn't anticipate catching one on um, a herring fillet, but you know what? It does happen. Um, we're going to clean up all my gear here now and we'll head up and um, Set up the tent, get some firewood, it's getting into the Arvo. That took forever. So good. Oh, I love it. Seriously, one of my favorite parts, just being able to set up camp out here in the middle of nowhere 
and um, just take it all in. Alright, we're going to zip it up before it gets filled with mozzies and flies. We'll enjoy that later on. Uh, we got a little bit of firewood. Probably going to go for a walk. Looks like there's a bit more up there. Oh yeah, I'll show you one of my little tricks that I often do. Because we got a bit of a sloping ground here. And I'll probably end up like sliding. So all I do is I, I might even uncoil it. I often do this. I'll get my rope and I just bunch it up. Normally not inside the tent. If it's raining, it would go inside the tent, I guess. Um, but if it's not raining, then it can go outside and just lay there and just um, my doorstop sort of just helps to prevent me from um, sliding too far. I can nestle into it. <laughs> That's it. Simple as. That's all I need. As long as my head's uphill, which I think it is, we'll find out tonight. Otherwise, I'll spin. Um, but yeah. because there's a little bit of moisture that was in the bottle when I chucked the oil in there. And um, back to my old trick, which is uh, panko. Panko groper in this case. Just need to get the sit flat. Slap some chunks in there. Far out they are chunky. And, um, We'll let that cook, hopefully not too fast that it burns. this on there just to hold it. Cupy. It's good stuff if you know. So this is my first trip back after all that YouTube saga that happened. Um, and if you haven't seen, there was no resolution really. YouTube said, hey, we stuffed up and that's it. Um, they never got back to me. I had to talk to them. Um, and I couldn't talk to them while I was demonetized. So anyway, we're back at it. I'm enjoying myself. We're gonna go for a hike down the coast tomorrow, I reckon. Try fish somewhere new. Uh, the swell should be better tomorrow, so I'm looking forward to that. And um, we've got a couple of days out here. I'm not sure how long I'll stay. We'll see when we run out of food and water, pretty much. <laughs> That's the plan, anyway. Um, anyway, cheers for watching, guys. See you tomorrow morning. <laughs>